A lot of locals. Here's a tell of the tape here. We got uh, Larry again, four and 10, and uh, Ramon, four and oh, with two knockouts. So hopefully we have a good fight here. Here we go. Nice job. Ramon's got some good speed, I gotta tell you. Yeah, nice sharp start from Ramon in the first tail. Okay, he's got a nice left hook. Very confident young man. Okay, he looks good, I gotta tell you. He keeps his hands up. Nice and composed. Yeah, he's got some speed. I mean, I, I, the first few fights, I haven't seen too much speed. And uh, it's nice to see somebody here that, that they can throw two or three jabs really quick. Yeah. <laughs> Still filling each other out. Nice little over hand, like looping right hand to the body from uh, Yanez. Nice jab from uh, Ramona. I think he's trying to figure this, figure Yanez out a little bit. Yeah, he keeps pumping them jobs. He'll see some openings. Two young fighters trying to get you know move up to the next level in the in the, in the pro ranks. Nice right hook from Yanez. Nice good little even match so far. Oh, nice, nice right hand. Oh, I got it. Uh, nice exchange from both fighters. Absolutely. Ramon's going to have to learn to keep his chin down, too, because he's throwing, you know, he's throwing some good shots, but I don't want to see him get caught with something wide. And as you can see, by his record, he's four and ten, but he, he has a nice power and his punches. He's very confident inside the square circle, for sure. Nice right nice, nice right body shot to the, from the right hand. Nice hook, nice hook there. Yeah, we Definitely uh, knows what he's doing. He knows how to control the fight with the jab. Yeah, staying on that front foot, keeping him, pushing him back. You know, one thing that uh, I get of Yenis, get, you know, his experience is showing a little bit because he's catching, he's catching uh, Ramon's jab and kind of counter. I don't see that too often. Ramon's just, just kind of, you know, measuring him up a little bit, you know. Oh, nice, nice shot. But see how he, he's got to keep that chin down. Nice he got hit in return. Yeah, nice comeback right hand from Yanez. It's all good if you land two or three good shots, but you don't want to get hit with the one that might be the one, you know. Yanez keeps going to the corners. Tell you what, uh, Ramon is keeping the pressure on, though. Good, exciting fight so far. Exciting first round, yeah. Fans trying to get him pumped up now. Well, I got to tell you that I, I do see Ramon is the more superior fighter, but uh, the, the experience of Yanez is what's carrying, carried him through that round and kept him in the fight a little bit. So I think hopefully it gets, it gets better every round. I, I, that was a good round for you know two young guys. Yeah, six rounds. Um, I'd like to see a step up now in round two. Here we go here. Is a, nice, is a nice shot, nice body shot by Ramon. But I gotta tell you, I give I give uh, Yanis a lot of credit because uh, he's staying in there and, and he's he's here to he's here to win. I don't think he just came to lay down. No, uh, he's here to win. Round two. Still smiling in the corner, so still pretty confident. Yeah. I mean, he's a veteran, you know. He's a veteran of a, you know. He's got uh, 14 pro fights, so he knows what he's doing a little bit. I would hope he's learned something. <laughs> He also fought on uh, on the last uh, Fire Fist promotion card here at the Coliseum back in uh, in June. Lost a decision to Joseph Fernandez, who we're going to see later tonight. Looks like uh, Ramon's corner kind of let him know about his jab being, you know, he's got to lead with it a little bit more. Yeah, straight out with three and four jabs. First. Nice part about I like about Ramon's jab is he actually steps in with it, so yeah. he makes you pay, you know, he makes you feel it. Feel the power. Nice right hand. Yeah. And there seems to be looking more to his feet. He's using the moon instead of looking on his eye contact. You're correct. Yeah, but he's using his experience to try yeah. to carry him through the round. Probably carrying his eyes down. Yeah. yeah, nice right hand from you. Nice body shot from Ramon. 
He needs him got to, you know, he should try to double that up a little bit. That body shot might have, might have got a little bit of, uh, you know, Larry because he kind of slowed down a little bit after that. He keeps taking, I see he's taking big deep breath now. So yeah. those body shots are definitely taking their effect. Nice right hand from uh, Ramon. Nice fall. Ramon, Ramon's knife. got some nice little moves though. You know, he likes, he knows how to step around. And there's trying to step around, but just too slow. Yeah. He's using again, I think it, to me these are just experienced moves that he's using to try to make him yeah, last see. the round. He tried to follow up with a left hook, but just just too slow off the mark. Right, yeah. But that's a beautiful, a beautiful setup if it works. A uh, nice little uppercut from uh, Yanez. Like I said, that's one thing about uh, Ramon, he's keeping his chin straight up in the air, so. Yeah. Ramon looking very focused. I remember those days. How about you, Connor? <laughs> You're still doing still it. Still doing it, yeah. <laughs> Only getting going. Yeah. Oh, nice oh, body nice shots hooks. again. Yeah, Dude, I tell you what, this is a pretty good little fight. Pretty good even fight out there. Yeah, now he's getting some confidence back. Yeah, he, I tell you what, he's a tough, he's, nice. a, he's a tough cat himself. He's here, to, he's here to win. He's not here, you know, just because his record says he's got 10 losses doesn't mean he wants to add another one. He's, he's doing everything he can to try to pull, you know, win this fight. Letting his hands go a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. Well, you listen, Ramon has stopped using his jab, so it's allowing Yanez to, you know, to get off first, which is is what Ramon needs to do. He needs to get back to that jab and get off first and, and control the pace. Yeah, like he was doing the first round on the start of this. Yeah. Three and four jabs at a time. Tell you what, man. Yanez is into this round. Yanez is opening up. Nice cheeky up on top. A little low ball shots there under the hips. So those again, those are the experienced shots you, from Yanez hitting, you know, throwing the right hook to the, to the hip. That'll slow you down. <laughs> nice nice right. right hand from Yanez. I'm going to tell yeah. you, that, tell you what, he might steal this round. I'm going to tell you, that's a good round for Yanez. <laughs> Look at He's very excited. I think he knows it. <laughs> Uh, we, got a, we got a fight in our hands, Trying I think. to get the crowd going now. Absolutely. I think we have a car fight on our hands. Great round from Yanez. I'd say I call out one each. There he goes. I mean, hey, that means Yanez is fighting. I mean, he got hit with that right hand a little bit, but he's coming back. And, you know, the, the, he's using his experience to kind of keep him in this fight. Nice body shot there by him. He started, he started to put the pressure on a little there it bit. There that Jab right hand landed by him. I mean, hey. He's gonna throw, there's that shot I was telling you about, that uppercut, because uh, Ramon is keeping his chin straight up in the air. Right now I have this fight 1-1, one, one. what about you? Yeah, I have it exactly the same. But it's a good fight, good even match, I gotta tell you, for a guy who only has five pro fights and a guy with 14, it's a really well matched fight. Exciting, Exciting to see the from a, a third round now to see what way this round goes. I got a feeling that Ramon's corner pretty much got all over him, so I'm, I'm expecting some, some fire from him. Yanez seems to be breathing a little bit more than Ramon, so. Yeah. It seems like Yanez is breathing, controlling the breathing a little bit, yeah. too, though. That's an experience. Still four rounds to go. See, he's, 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 uh, Yanez is throwing that lead uppercut, which doesn't normally work. But Ramon is not seeing it, so he's not, th he's not countering with a left hook to the chin, because if he did, it would, probably, it would land clean every time he threw it. Yeah, he's letting him get a little bit too close. Instead of staying outside with the jab. He's, he's getting away from, from his jab, and now he's, he's throwing a few of them there. Oh. He just can't give up. He got hit with an overhand right. Keeping that hand down. I tell you, Larry Yanez is here to win this fight tonight. He's gonna, he's, he wants to upset the, the, the undefeated young, you know, up-and-coming from the Tampa Bay area. His confidence is just growing now. You can Absolutely. see it in his movements. Nice little right hand from Ramon there, but he kind of it's one punching in it now. He's got to get back to his jab. Yeah, he's he there. Nice little right hand, little hook. And there you go. But he, see, he's, he's just standing he, there. Yeah. Yep. He throws two punches and he lets Yanez come back with four and five. Yeah. Oh, there's the uppercut in the hook. I got to tell you this. <laughs> man, what a fight. Yeah. We got a good fight here tonight. Some great exchanges from both guys. Yeah, I tell you what, Yanez is not going, he's not going away easy. I got to tell you, he's going to make, if you beat him, he's going to make you earn it. He's roughing him up now. Yes, he is. You know why? He's letting the hands go. At the end of the day, that's the difference here. Ramon's kind of just trying to get a one shot. Yep, a nice one shot. shot. Yep. 
Yep. Yanez is working there, a little bit harder. There's that same harder. shot. There's that shot to that hip again. I yeah. mean, I, I mean, the referee hasn't called it yet. I'm very surprised because it's pretty wide open. <laughs> yeah. The, uh, it's funny because I think I think Ramon got a little tired. If you see his speed, it's kind of died down on it. Yep. 100 percent. One, two punches at a time where he was throwing. Yeah, no, four they got hit jabs. again. Yeah, Ramon hit yeah. again by right hand from Yanez. Oh, man, yeah, again. Hey, Yanez is letting him go. He needs to watch that. Keep his hands up a little yeah, bit higher. Yeah, 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 there you go. Yanez is the, the moves I and mean, the experience is what's winning this fight for him because I, right now I feel I have him winning this round. Yanez is throwing a lot more punches. Once they get under those exchanges. See Ramon, Ramon's lip is all swollen. Oh, there you go. So see, that's what he needs to go do. He needs to let those hands go right there. But he can, he, he's close. He needs where he needs to be, but he's kind of tying up. His left hand's oh, Nice right out. hand, nice right hand. I think Yanez might be getting a little tired, huh? Oh, nice right hook, nice. Left, left hook. I think, yeah, there you go. I tell you what, this is a good fight. It's a, it's a, it's a tough round to, to, to call there because I would say Yanez won pretty much what uh, two minutes of that fight and, yeah. and, and then lost probably the last 30 seconds of it. So uh, I'm still going to give him that round. I just felt that he did a little bit more, even though that he got caught with some cleaner shots towards the end of it. Yeah, I would agree with you, David. Uh, Yanez, I think that a little bit more in that round also. He came, he came to win. He's not definitely, he's not here to lay down. I got to tell you. So with me, I give it two rounds to one so far. I do, yeah. But he's getting glad. I can see him breathing heavy there. So hopefully he's not getting tired because that's what he did show towards that last part of that round. Was a little bit, he seems like he was back to back a little bit. Yeah, Ramon has a little bit more control. And there's his mouth is open wide, gasping for there. Oh, maybe that's just how he does it. This is the last round? To the four six rounder, right? Nope, it's not, it's not the last round. <laughs> I guess it's a six round fight, so we got two, what, two more rounds? Yeah, this is round number four, so two more after this. Well, the crowd is trying to wake Ramon up, but I think, you know, Ramon's, I think the experience from Yanez is kind of throwing Ramon off a little bit. I think he's just fell in that little bubble after the first round. Yeah, at least he's trying to, I think, I think he's, you know, he's finally starting to get his jab in, from a distance because that's where his fight is. So he, beautiful one-two shot right there, went with a right hand to the body because he's, he's using his jab. But he, then he, there, there he goes, steps back, chin up in the air. He's got to, he's got to learn to keep that chin down. Nice shot, there you go, Ramon, nice body work. And that's what he needs to do. He doesn't need to stop and wait. Start, starting to see to some speed back now. Yeah, I think he's starting. He... Nice left hook over the top from Ramon. He doesn't need, he doesn't need to be that close to Yanez because you know, his, his best fight is staying outside using his jab. Yanez is going to be there no matter what. Yeah, it's just down there. He needs to step on an angle. Nice, right nice one-two again. I got a tip of the gin. He's got to follow with the hook with that. Especially Yanez when the guy talking. likes to drop his hands. Yeah. <laughs> Yanez torn with him a little bit. Yeah, he's talking. Trying to egg him on a little. Yeah. Again, that's him using that experience, just trying anything he can to kind of keep him, get him off his rhythm. Right now, you know, Ramon seems like he's gotten his rhythm a little bit this round. I think Yanez is just dancing around a little to try to yeah. get some breather. Oh, nice body nice shot. Hook, body. Oh, that one took a lot out of him. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's, yes. Nice right hand from Ramon again. Yeah, he's he's looking for the kill. Yanez fighting back. Yeah, Yanez like it. He, Yanez didn't, he didn't come here to lay tonight. He huh. came here to win, and I tell you what, he's, he, he got to give the guy credit. He's trying to counter with his own left hook to the body now. I don't know about you. I felt that body shot. And Ramon dropping his hands and kind of, there you go. See, he's, Ramon's best fight is from a distance. Yeah. Right now he's got his chin in the air and he's just letting Ramon let the, you know, uh, let Yanez kind of let his hands go and Ooh. keeping it close. Nice uppercut from Ramon. Yes. Punish out the exchange. Nice 
if uh, Ramon looked like he tried to throw an elbow. <laughs> nice, nice uppercut there. He, that one landed from Ramon. See, Ramon needs to get away from there. He doesn't need to be that close to him. Everything he lands, he lands from a distance. I think he's, he's you know, he's keeping the fight close by doing that. I mean, good, good, good round, good round for Ramon. I think he, you know, he came out, you know, getting with a little bit more confidence again and took control of the fight. I yeah. think it did enough, it did, did more than enough to take that round. So I think we have a two-two round. Yeah, right I think now. it's pretty even at this stage. Yeah. Going into round five. Starting to get his confidence back a little. Some speed in these punches in that round. You know, and these are the fights that these young guys need, in my opinion. They need fights that guys are, you know, the guy's not coming to just lay down. I mean, we'll see here, he's gonna, right here, you know, he's letting his hands go a little bit, and he's gonna, yeah, you know, there's that body shot, that, that body shot that I can't tell you what, I can't believe he took it, because it was right on the money. That was a beautiful shot. But Yanez, again, letting his hands go and trying to stay in the fight. As you said, David, he's, he's just staying a little bit too close, not, not getting to do what he can do. Yeah. So back again, you know, I like when young guys have guys that are here to fight, you know. Listen, we all want to win, and, and to go out there and, and, and punch, hit the guy once and knock him out, that's not, we're not learning anything from it. This type of fight you learn a lot from. They go back home from here and watch tape and, and, and work on their mistakes. You know, yeah. win is great. Winning is great, but oh. learning from your mistake is even better. Yeah. <laughs> that was a nice left hook yes. from Ramon there. Ramon, Ramon, I think, is starting to, his, his, he's probably starting to get his second win. He's, he's realizing that keeping straight punches are what landing for him. It opens everything else up. Round number you. five now, so if he wants to, if he wants to put him away, you gotta, Put the pressure on a little nice bit for more. Hand again. Hey, but I got to tell you again, I'm giving Yanez credit, man. He's here to win. He's here to try to win this fight. He's not laying down for nothing. He's right. making he's making Ramon earn this fight. Yep, he's trying. Egg, trying to egg him on again. There, see, that's a good thing with Ramon. Don't fall for it. Just use your jab. But see, now he's uh, trying to lead with the hook. And sloppy left hook. Yanez trying to use his experience to try to get him off that rhythm again. Yeah, nice little shot again there. Nice hook. See the difference? See if it, once he gets that distance, how, how much cleaner yeah. those punches land? This is a, young kid, young, a good young kid with a, that I think has got a lot of potential. Nice. Yeah, he definitely, right. definitely has some skill. He's got to learn to keep that chin down because he's getting hit with some overhand rights. They're not doing much to him, but still. You don't want to get hit with, with, with those punches with the guy that can't punch. Yeah. <laughs> nice little counter off that body shot. Nice little uppercut to the head. Ramon again, kind of posing a little bit. He needs to get back to that jab. Yan is letting his hands go. Getting hit with the cleaner shot, so. And that's falling on. Trying to get on nice and close. Let's see, Ramon was trying to set up an uppercut there, but you gotta be careful he doesn't get hit with an, a, a hook. There it is. Hey, again, I'm very, uh, I'm very proud that they made this match because I think this fight, this is a good match for, for a young kid. You know, he, was, he didn't just come in here and oh, knock oh, on oh, a nice that. hook. Nice hook again, yeah. there it is. Yeah, but you know, you can't, it's one punch at a time. Yeah. He has to learn to throw that hook in the right hand behind it. Yeah, double it up right hand or just throw something behind it. Nice right hand there. Throw He's looking for the nice kill now. Yeah. Very nice again. He just has to be careful he doesn't, there it is. You gotta be careful he doesn't keep that chin up in the air. His fist is marked up a lot. Yes, it is. A rough fight. Probably tougher oh. than I think he expected it. Yeah. He's been caught a lot after after he throws his punches. And, I, and he can't. Hey, I'm glad. He, I'm glad he landed some punches there. He can't give away the last 10 seconds of a round. I still think Ramon did enough to win that round because he won again the majority of the round. Yeah. But I'm glad that this fight is going the distance because I feel that he's going to learn a lot from this fight. It's going to only benefit him better going forward with his career. Yeah, definitely. That's an exciting fight. Probably the most exciting fight of the night so far. Well, definitely the longest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> here, see, see here, that right hand is just that. 
throw that there, you know, he's throwing combinations. He threw a right hand and a hook off of it. As you say, he's much better at range. His then he gets are... close. He gets close. He's going to get hit with some with, with the shot. Boom! There's that hook. Nice left hook. Should have been a right hand behind it. <laughs> the right hand came about four seconds too late. Yeah. Here we go. Round number six. Last round. Here we go. Things going to be exciting round. round. That's a good. Hit. This is a very good fight. I, have, I tell you. Both of them have the heart now, so I'd say this will be an exciting round. See, he's getting hit with that overhand, right? Don't stay in there, there's no reason. Toe to toe from the to bell. Going at it, and Giannis wants his fight bad. Yeah. I think, he's, I think he needs a knockdown to, to, to pull it off, but anything, you know what, anything is possible. <laughs> you still catch some of those body shots? Yeah. They're more, they're more like back shots. Yeah. The looping hooks. Yeah, and it's getting a little wild there. there. And that's why I think Ramon, Ramon's a little tired, so he's staying, he's staying close when he needs to get back on his toes, use his jab, and, you know, and throw from a range, because that's, that's where he's landing his cleaner shots. But again, that's, that's, that, this is what you learn from watching this tape. Yeah, it's definitely a learning fight for Ramon. Oh, nice right hand there from Ramon. Nice again. My right, uppercut up, yep. Kippy got caught himself. I tell you what, Giannis definitely doesn't want to go away quietly, does he? I think them veteran fighters are more difficult <laughs> yeah. than it's experience. experience. Yeah. Nice double hook from Ramon there. You should, you know, I would like to have seen him do that a little bit more early in the fight. You know, sometimes Ramon seems like he's over, he's over looking at it, like trying too hard to land at that big shot and instead of just letting his hands go and let the let the punch come to him, you know? Yeah, he's just standing there also. There. He's landing some nice shots right here, that yeah. uppercut, nice uppercut. All he's got to do is get some room here and let the hands go. There it is, nice, nice, nice step around. He's looking for the finish. And Giannis ain't gonna let him take it easy. And right hand right there. See, he should have landed yeah. right hand right there. He took a step back, the chin was there. Step back and step the side. Stay to keep, you know, you know, he's keeping his distance. That's where he needs to be. That's where it needs to be. Giannis will come at him with his chin up, <laughs> just like that. Nice body shot from Ramon. Nice combination. Yep. Oh, he had right it there. Again, he yeah. saw it. He saw it. <laughs> Romano's fist about marked up. Oh, nice body shot again from Ramon. Again, I think Gian Giannis is tired. I think he's. I think this is he's pretty much finished. If Ramon wanted to step it up and maybe finish it up. Giannis is very difficult though. He's bobbing and weaving all different angles. Not making it easy. Nice, nice body shot again. Body yeah. From yeah, that oh, nice hook. That's hook the best shot. It's probably his best shot of the night. Yeah. Giannis very tough. I tell you what, that was a good fight for the fans, great fight for experience for the young uh, Ramon de la Paz. I hope that he takes this fight, watches the tape, and learns a lot from it because he did some good things, he did some bad things, but I think he did enough to hold the win off tonight. Yep. Uh, every fighter has a different style. Card. We go to great the card, great fight, man, great fight. I tell you, Judge great Michelle fight. Judge Michelle Walker Serrano scores the bout 60-54. Judge Thomas Nardoni scores the bout 59-55. And Judge Jed O'Connor scores the bout 58-56. That's what we had it. For yep. the winner, by unanimous decision, Ramon Monti. De La Paz Junior. A very good decision. I felt that he won, you know, four out of the six rounds. It's a good again. I keep repeating myself, but it's a it's a great experience fight for him to look over.